Good morning, North. It's your boy Jerry, aka Family J, back at it again with the Daily North Vibe Live. Today is April 6, 2022. I'm Sinai, and this is Jerry. So let's get straight into today's news. The one and only. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now please remain standing for a moment of silence. You may now be seated. Let's run down the schedule or calendar for April real quick. Tabletop Gaming Club meets this Thursday on Lehman uh, Room 2B. Don't forget Spring Recess is coming up. We're off April 14th to 18th, which is kind of whack, but, you know, that's whatever. April. And April 13th, April 13th, the day before break is packed full of ama amazing activities during Block 1 and Block 2, the PBIS Word event, popcorn in the movie, and joy a relaxing break with the movie, A League of Their Own. But wait, fourth block on April 13th is co is co-ed volleyball tournament profiting reading Olympics. That's going to be quite a day. Interested in creating a team? Then you'll need six players per team, and it must be co-ed, meaning you will need at least two players of each gender. It's five dollars per play or three dollars a team. Preliminary rounds will be third block on April 13th, but anyone can watch the finals during fourth block. A dollar donation gets you a ticket to witness the finals. When we come back from break, April still keeps giving us events. April 22nd to the 24th is our show in the Spring Music School on the island. The, an the annual Smash Brothers Brawl video game tournament will be held over two days this year. Elimination rounds will be, hold will be held Tuesday, April 26th and Thursday, April 28th from 3 p.m. to 5.15 p.m. It's $5 to play and $3 to watch. Registration opens later this week, so check here our socials and our emails your emails for more information. Second blood drive is on April 26th. You still have time to register. Check your emails for a link from Miss New. The Potter Puff football game will be April 27th from 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. It's shaping up to be an amazing game. Seniors, last day to pay for prom is April 8th. Payments are only accepted during lunch in front of the cafeteria or after school till 5 p.m. In, in the front lobby. No other payment times will be available, only in front of the cafeteria. Cap and gallon prices have increased to about $40. Make sure you order yours before the next increase in May. And finally, seniors who wish to pay $70 for the senior trip to Kalahari, you can start paying on April 8th during lunch in front of the cafeteria. There's still time to recycle your plastics in front of the Northside Cafe to help the King Leo Club with the plastic bench of the courtyard. Take a picture of yourself with your recycling deposit in front of the bench and earn a North Star. And now over to Anthony with sports. Parker, not Anthony, uh, with your sports news. The March Madness Men's Tournament has ended, and candidates are the national championships after completing the, big, completing the biggest halftime comeback in national championship history. 
It was a great game with Candace Scar, Christian Braun, having 12 points and 12 assists to help lead Candace to the fourth national title. And a big, and a big trade in the NFL, the Philadelphia Eagles traded the 16th, 19th, and 194th pick to the Saints for the 18th, 101st, and the 237th pick for next year's first round pick and a 2024 second round pick. This really shakes up the draft and shows the Eagles are trying to spread out their assets, which is a good decision seeing how their team is built. The Eagles seem like they have a true plan. Now with me to the weather. Hey y'all, it's me again with your weather and today will be a high of 52 degrees in the day and a low of 42 degrees over in the night and we will have rain with cloudy skies during the day so make sure you have you all umbrellas but back to Jerry and Sanaya we have another would you rather question would you rather be able to take back anything you say or hear any conversation that is about you I rather take I rather hear any conversation about me because you know because I need to know right I agree if someone talking mess about me like I need to know like who is it and what are they talking about how about you partner um I'd rather take back anything I really say so if I like mess, I'll be back. Okay, I can get rid of that. Blah, blah, blah. But back to you guys. That's all we have for today. Have a great day and stay with Monty Wolves. Oh. Oh. Three. Down here. And cut. That was a lot.